presenting the one, the only, the original, Ernest P. Worrell in his first motion picture. Uh, Ernest goes to camp. Rated PG. Know what I mean? Starts Friday at a theater near you. Check your local newspaper. In the past, there have been many traditional ways to celebrate Christmas. With songs, with gifts, with family and friends. There's a new way. Ho, 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 Bert. With Ernest. <laughs> Ernest P. Worrell. Yeah. He's back. Know what I mean? Back to save Santa. Santa's in the slammer. Look at those beady, twinkling eyes. Back to save Christmas. <laughs> Back to save face. Your dead meat. That's life for you. Isn't she a doll? Ernest <laughs> T. Laurel. Mr. Funtime. In the mission they said couldn't be done. On Comet. On Cupid. On Donder. In the movie they said shouldn't be done. Don't be grumpy. Uh, a blister. Blister. You guys say you have a problem with reindeer? <laughs> Trim the tree. Light the candle. Deck the hall. And hit the deck. Cause Ernest P. Oral's coming to town. And he's coming with colorful cards and festively wrapped packages. Air brakes. <laughs> Ernest saves Christmas. America's prison system, a feared and powerful institution, about to be brought to its knees by one desperate man. Oh, uh, I don't think our table has any steak sauce. Touchstone Pictures presents Ernest P. Warren. Why are you such a screw-up? I'm just that kind of guy. He was just a simple man. The perfect choice. European styling with a decidedly American flair. Trying to lead a good, clean life. <laughs> Until he fell in with the wrong crowd. Ended up in jail. The who scale, the slammer, the joint, Alcatraz, San Quentin, Sing Sing. And got sent to the chair. The hot seat, the dead meat, deep six, it's over, pal. You're out of here, Bob. Oh, by mistake. That's not fair. Burn him. <laughs> But when they tried to charge him with 10,000 volts of electricity... Hit the alarm! Ernest P. Warren... Electro Man... ...took charge. It's all in the wrist. What got you surrounded? Is this the way you treat your mother? Three, two, one and a half. This spring... It's the screen's most magnetic personality. <laughs> I recommend the lobster. In the most electrifying Ernest adventure of all. He's had a real hard day. Ernest goes to... Jail! From Touchstone Pictures, first there was Jason, then there was Freddy. Now, terror has a new name. Ernest, Scared Stupid, an all-new movie rated PG starts Friday, October 11th at a theater near you. It was a secret of history that couldn't stay hidden forever. Someone is finally poking their nose about. It was a prize too rich to ignore. Well, that would mean that the crown jewels residing in the Tower of London are fakes. Absolutely. Now all the world wants what Dr. Abdur Mellon has found. And only one man stands beside him. <laughs> From the director of Ernest Goes to Camp comes a compelling story of man overcoming obstacles. Oh. 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 I did it! Of people oh. thrown together by fate. Nobody's driving the truck! Welcome to my world! And a really big cannon stuffed with jewels that just might change the world. England will have a new king. Stand back, you groveling minions, and prepare to meet your sovereign. Ernest cries again. Ah! Ernest, are you dead? 
Oh, I guess I would be if I weren't just that close to being an actual cartoon. This time, he's packing firepower. Ernest rides again. You'll want to bring the whole family. Oh, no, Zaev. My whole family, rest their souls, were in this way grossly abused. <laughs> okay, Vern, I'm going to explain this one more time. It's my new movie. Ernest goes to school, and it's a whole lot of fun, and, and here's my locker, and, and the football team, and cafeteria food, and Vern, they actually let me handle some real books. Vern, if you've got any more chalk, I, it's okay. I'll just use this pen. See, what we're... Oh, yeah. Ew. Doesn't that sound awful? It, it kind of reminds you of this. Know what I mean? Good morning, Mr. Worrell. You're looking at a trap. Cleverly devised by the evil genius, Baron Von Titleist. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, will be to rid the world of this menace and make this geriatric pastime safe again for all of humanity. He's been to Kent. He's been to Africa. He's even saved Christmas. <laughs> but what Ernest needed was a real challenge. You gonna make it? It'd be a whole lot better if you'd let me drive. This is an army vehicle and it's to be only driven by army people. You could enlist. The army. Yeah, maybe that's it. Gentlemen, this is your GMC Napa Sonoma Mendocino 3000. It is the ultimate urban assault vehicle. It has 67 cylinders, 3,000 horsepower, seating capacity, one. So now, Private Ernest... Want an ooey gooey toad gummy? Oh no, they're too sticky for me. ...is serving Uncle Sam. Out of the entire United States Armed Forces, you and you alone have been chosen as an elite fighting unit. I am Colonel Gullet. You will be under my direct command while on this peacekeeping mission to Kerifistan. I can't go to Kerifistan. I don't know anybody in Kerifistan. I don't speak Kerifistanese. And besides, my lips will peel. He's Lee. Shoulders back! Stomach in! He's me. <laughs> Give me the mind, Private. He's a fully trained fighting machine. General! And this time, it's not just another job. Combat? You're stopping the entire combined force of the world for a jellyfish? Or would you like to just swim fast? Give me 20, soldier. It's an adventure. You know you need one of these. Let me see that. 50 bucks. 50 bucks? Do I look like I have stupid written all over my face? 60 bucks. What's the movie on this flight? Have you seen Ernest? Following in the footsteps of the world's greatest heroes. I am good buddy now. Good buddy forever. Comes a different kind of soldier. <laughs> <laughs> Who do they think you are? Rambo! Well, close. Ernest in the army. Let the games begin. This is Dr. Love, and we'll have the tip-off right after a brief message from Elton John's Auto Repair. All right, guys, hold up. Now, watch that big cornbread fed looking brother over there setting picks. Now, when that happens, TJ, you switch with me. A bear. Not now, Ernest. Watch. Look, you can't muscle that big bear. ugly forward, man. I mean, if Bigfoot even tries it, I'm out on that. Bro. Just be cool. Now, Willie. You got to hit the three tonight. If I believe I can achieve. Barry. Not now, Ernest, because that'll free up Tommy T in the lane. All right, now, if you can't hit it, I'll hit the three. I'll be there, all right? Barry. What, Ernest? Uh, I made lemonade for the whole team with real lemon. Just not the mix, not the powder. It's the real stuff. See, it's still got lemon peel floating in it. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thanks, Ernest. Everybody in here. All right. Let's do this. Clean sweep! Go team. It's right over here if you want it. The clean sweep take the floor here at the City Memorial Gym, and we are ready to go. All right, fellas, when a good thing game, watch the rough stuff in the hand checks, okay, ready? Freeze! Action photos for everybody's locker. <laughs> Ernest, I want you to sit down on the bench and don't get up, you hear me? Over here on our side? Yes, over here on our side. Oh, 
sorry. There's bad blood between these two teams. Last year's game ended in a bench clearing brawl. What's happening? What it is, bro? Shibop, shibop, doo wop, doo wop. Quang dang, shamalama ding dong. <laughs> Good morning, Mr. Worrell. You're looking at a trap, cleverly devised by the evil genius, Baron Von Titleist. Your mission, should you choose to accept it, will be to rid the world of this menace and make this geriatric pastime safe again for all of humanity. He's been to Ken. He's been to Africa. He's even saved Christmas. <laughs> but what Ernest needed was a real challenge. You gonna make it? It'd be a whole lot better if you'd let me drive. This is an army vehicle and it's to be only driven by army people. You could enlist. The army. Yeah, maybe that's it. Gentlemen, this is your GMC Napa Sonoma Mendocino 3000. It is the ultimate urban assault vehicle. It has 67 cylinders, 3,000 horsepower, seating capacity, one. So now, Private Ernest... Want an ooey gooey toad gummy? Oh no, that's too stinky for me. ...is serving Uncle Sam. Out of the entire United States Armed Forces, you and you alone have been chosen as an elite fighting unit. I am Colonel Gullet. You will be under my direct command while on this peacekeeping mission to Kerifistan. I can't go to Kerifistan. I don't know anybody in Kerifistan. I don't speak Kerifistanese. And besides, my lips will peel. He's Lee. Shoulders back! Stomach in! He's me. <laughs> Give me the mind, Private. He's a fully trained fighting machine. General! And this time, it's not just another job. Combat? You're stopping the entire combined force of the world for a jellyfish? Or would you like to just swim fast? Give me 20, soldier! It's an adventure! You know you need one of these. Let me see that. Fifty bucks. Fifty bucks? Do I look like I have stupid written all over my face? Sixty bucks. What's the movie on this flight? Have you seen Ernest? Following in the footsteps of the world's greatest heroes. I am good buddy now. Good buddy forever. Comes a different kind of soldier. <laughs> <laughs> Who do they think you are? Rambo! Well, close. Ernest in the Army. Let the games begin. <laughs> 